My name is Chantal Mollet. I was born in Alice Springs, but grew up here. My name is Stacy Davis, born and raised here. My favorite food is tea misoto. I was born in Alice Springs Hospital, but I grew up here. My name is Muriel Williams, and I live at Santa Teresa Community, where I was born in Alice Springs. My name is Jody Young. I grew up here. I started painting here yes, since I was a you know, young mum. I've been working at Kringart for nearly three, four years now. I used to work at the school before. Two years ago I started working here. About two, three years now. I've been working here. Yes, I used to see my mum do painting. She used to work here before. I used to see my auntie too on painting. That's why I used to stay with her and see her what she's doing. I used to watch my mum paint. That's how I learned how to paint on canvas and mixing paint. When I started, when I was 16, um, I used to do colours, but not real colours. I used to use white and orange, doing some dots. That's how Miss Wallace taught me how to paint. The main inspiration is some colors uh, from the nature. Most of it, no, most of the colors, just favorite colors. I like the dark colors. I do different style, but in same colors. That was in my mind. It just come. It just came out of my head. And my mom used to do her favorite color used to be the purple and the green. I just make my own choice. Even though when I come out quick, I see the colors and, you know, get it in my mind and come back and mix the paint around the community, you know. I don't use any bright colors. And I like the background of the, um, my canvas of background. I like the dark brown. I would like to do a story about what I'm doing on the painting because I've got stories. Blue is my favorite color. <laughs> That's why I use dark blue, light blue, dark blue, mm -hmm. greenish blue or something. Yeah. Well, first, I start on drawing pattern on canvas and then decide which colour you're going to use and then just keep going and put dots. It comes little by little, having a break to think about it, what pattern to do. It depends on the colour, what colour do I have to match it on. Sometimes it'll be a couple of days to mix the colours, starting from the dark colours to light colours, so I mix white paint to yellow, make yellow light, green, blue, purple. Sometimes it takes four colors to make the right color to fill up the bottle. 20, 30 minutes per color. Then after that, we'll mix another color into that other color to make it another color. That glass over there, did that and some ceramics. November 2014, Kringer Arts has got an exhibition down in Melbourne and uh, over the last 12 months I've been selecting works to take down. Now the process has been if I see a really lovely piece of ceramic or canvas out in the gallery, I bring it aside and put it in here. 
Now I've had to actually go through the work as well and pull out more work for another exhibition. So here we've got what's going to Melbourne on this table of ceramics and over here is what's not going to Melbourne but will go down to Adelaide in next year. Under the table we've got the canvases that are going to go to Melbourne. I'm looking forward to go to the Melbourne expedition on November and December. Meeting other artists and seeing their art and how they do it. Oh, not fair. Yeah, we went there. We had to do the wrapping. I went once, that was this year, to Avonhoon. So take care of the gallery, do the sales, welcome the tourists. Show them around and tell them which paintings or which artists. Sometimes around the place.